I put peanut butter in my friend's drink thinking she was lying about her allergy. I was young, only in the second grade and had recently been taught about lying. After our lessons on sinning and doing bad stuff, I developed the idea that my friend, let's call her Lily, was lying about her peanut allergy and just didn't like peanut butter but was too ashamed to tell me because they were my favorite snack at the time. Not to mention the times when someone would bring in a snack for the class. And we'd always have to check if they had peanuts in them. If they did, the whole class couldn't eat them so that she wouldn't feel left out. I was tired of what I thought was a dumb, made up lie and decided to take matters into my own hands by bringing a big jar of peanut butter and waiting for the perfect moment to strike. Once it's snack break I waited until Lily went to the bathroom to take out my peanut butter jar to slip a spoonful into her cup, shaking it good so she wouldn't suspect a thing. Once she came back, she sat down and drank some of her peanut butter infused water. As she did so I watched with white eyes making sure to take in every detail, now convinced that she's been lying the whole time. Suddenly, Lily started coughing uncontrollably, choking and thrashing herself all over the floor. It also didn't help that she forgot her EpiPen at home that day, causing her to convulse and forcing my teacher to call an ambulance. It turned out she was severely allergic to peanut butter and I never had the goal to tell her what I had done that day. We're still friends today and she strongly believes that her father was trying to kill her that day since she got in a fight with him the day before regarding her dead mother. My brother called to tell me I killed his baby. I'm having a total breakdown and I don't have anyone I can talk to. Three weeks ago I apparently contracted COVID. I had no symptoms, but I visited my brother and him and his wife's new baby. Then they got sick and tested positive, I tested positive too, completely asymptomatic. Two weeks later my nephew develops a fever of over 100 degrees. My brother and his wife take the baby to the hospital and he tests positive for COVID. They send him home BC his oxygen levels are fine and to monitor it. He was fine and then within 36 hours got abruptly worse. They took him back to the hospital and apparently his liver was badly damaged. They did a spinal tap and he had some sort of infection on top of COVID and he didn't make it. He was less than two months old, it took my brother and his wife five years to conceive. I had no idea I was sick, I sanitized my hands before I held him, I even tested the day before I went over and I was negative, I thought I was fine. My brother called me and he was super drunk, screaming at me that I killed his baby, I'm not invited to the funeral, I should have died instead. No one else in my family will speak to me. I'm terrified to leave my room, I've been calling out of work and just hiding under my blankets. I can't describe how guilty I feel, I don't know how I can keep breathing. I don't know what to do.